When I first showcased some discrete op apps in previous videos, some viewers commented with praise for the Muses O2. Some of you claim that these op apps are every bit as good, if not better, than some discrete designs, and that they're among the best sounding op apps available, and that all IC op amps should not be painted with the same brush. And I agree. I was definitely overgeneralizing in those videos for illustration purposes only. With that said, that praise got me curious. So I reached out to Nishinbo Micro Devices to see if these glowing reviews held up to scrutiny. Thankfully, they were kind enough to send me a set for this review. And let me tell you, they did not disappoint. The Muses O2 is not your typical IC op amp. These were designed for hi-fi from the ground up, not repurposed from decades old designs that simply get the job done. Everything about the Muses O2 screams precision, purpose, and passion for sound. But what makes them so special? Let's dive into the details. Starting with total harmonic distortion, the Muses O2 boasts an impressive 0.001% distortion. To put that into perspective, let's compare it to the JRC4558, Nishimbo's own design from decades earlier and a highly regarded op amp with 0.005 THD. The Muses O2 has five times lower distortion ensuring clarity and transparency in your audio. Next is input noise voltage, a critical factor for maintaining a quiet signal. The Muses O2 delivers an impressively low 4.5 nanovolts per square root hertz. Compare that to the OPA 2134 at 8 nanovolts and the OPA 2604 at 10 nanovolts. The Muses O2 cuts noise in half, preserving subtle details in your music. The gain bandwidth product is another standout. The Muses O2 clocks in at 11 megahertz, nearly four times better than that of the JRC4558 at three megahertz. This ensures precise reproduction even of the most complex audio signals. And let's talk about slew rate, which measures how quickly an op amp can respond to the rapid changes in input signal. The Muses O2's five volts per microsecond may seem modest compared to some, but it's perfectly optimized for hi-fi audio, striking a balance between speed and stability. Outperforming the jrc 4558s one volt per microseconds by five times. It ensures that fast transients are responded with accuracy without introducing instability. The Muses O2 is packed with features tailored for audiophiles. Channel separation is one key area where this op amp absolutely dominates all the others. At 150 dB, it's miles ahead of anything else on the market. While some competitors are respectable in this category, the Muses O2 makes them look downright ordinary. This spec alone underscores how it was purpose built for hi-fi. Common mode rejection ratio and power supply rejection ratio are equally impressive, both exceeding 110 dB. By contrast, op amps like the NE5532, the JRC4580, and the JRC4558 top out at 95 dB for CMRR and 85 dB for PSRR. These differences translate directly into cleaner sound, free from power supply interference and hum. And we can't ignore the impressive output current drive capability. The Muses O2 delivers a whopping plus or minus 50 milliamps of current, far exceeding all other op amps in this group by as much as five times or more. This capability is a testament to its audio focused design, allowing it to drive demanding loads effortlessly. Simply put, the Muses O2 lays the smackdown on the competition as far as this spec is concerned. The Muses O2 is a product born from decades of expertise and relentless design for hi-fi audio. Its lineage traces back to the NJM4558 and the NJM4580, now known as the JRC4558 and the JRC4580. 
due to the company's rebranding from the New Japan Radio Corporation Limited to the Nishinbo Micro Devices. These iconic off-amps set the stage for what would become one of the most refined, integrated hi-fi off-amps ever created. Driven by a philosophy of excellence, the Musa series is built around principles of superior circuit design, unique processes, advanced materials, and meticulous assembly technology. Achieving a superior integrated hi-fi op-amp isn't just about specs, it's about strategy. On page 9 of their technical presentation, Nishimbo outlines their design approach, focusing on four key areas, circuit design, process uniqueness, special materials, and assembly technology. Circuit design, as detailed on page 10, ensures precision and low distortion. Process uniqueness, shown on page 11, incorporates innovative manufacturing techniques for consistency and reliability. On page 12, we see how the use of oxygen-free copper and of advanced materials guarantees thermal stability and long-term performance. These materials help ensure that the op-amp specs don't drift and maintain a consistency over time, minimizing the effect of heat has on performance. But specs only tell part of the story. How do they sound? Imagine my disappointment when I tried to install these in my topping DX3 Pro Plus headphone amplifier, only to discover that an op-amp upgrade is not available for that device due to the lack of dip 8 sockets. This drove me to think of how impressive the current drive capabilities of the Muse's O2 would impact high impedance headphones. While I couldn't test them in my own headphone amp, these off amps are an excellent upgrade choice for headphone amplifiers with upgradable DIP8 sockets. Their impressive current drive capability ensures they can handle high impedance loads with ease, delivering smooth, dynamic performance unlocking the full potential of demanding headphones. Something tells me I'm going to need a new headphone amp. Next, I installed the Muses O2 into my Fozzy Audio V3 mono amplifiers. Listening through some speakers, the soundstage expanded due to the jaw-dropping 150 dB of channel separation, and details emerged with incredible clarity. These op amps truly brought this system to life. A lot of what I learned about the Muses O2 comes directly from Nishimbo micro devices themselves. They provided detailed slides explaining the design philosophy behind these op amps, and I've linked those slides in the description for your reference. Additionally, Dale Wilson from All About Circuits and Joe Samanis from Nishimbo dive deep into the Muses series in a much watched video on the Mauser website. I've also linked that below along with the Muses data sheet. I want you to hear how delicious these op amps sound. So to close, I'm playing three royalty cleared music clips directly from my ZD3 DAC. By eliminating room acoustics and microphone issues, you'll hear exactly what these op amps bring to the table, albeit with a little YouTube compression thrown in, unfortunately. In the end, I emphatically agree with my viewers. The Muses O2 are every bit as good as suggested and are without a doubt among the best sounding integrated op amps I've heard, ever heard. These are no doubt designed for hi-fi from the ground up and it shows in every note, every detail, and in every moment of pure listening bliss. If you're looking for an integrated op amp that was built for music lovers, the Muses O2 commands your attention. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more reviews. Until next time, happy listening. Run, boy, run. The sun will be guiding you. Run, boy, run. They're dying to stop you. Run, boy, run. This race is a prophecy. Run, boy, run. Break out from society. Hey, hey, and you don't have to hide away, yeah. You'll be my boy, but for now it's time to run, it's time to run. Hey,
Afraid to turn up out of the blue Uninvited but I couldn't stay away I couldn't fight it I had hoped you'd see my face And that you'd be reminded that for me It isn't over Crave a different kind of buzz Let me be your 